Hello friends, Justin Helm here with another look. Inside the broadcast, COVID-19 has had a profound effect on broadcasting. Some of its effects are obvious and some are more obscure. Announcers have resorted to calling sporting events off-site. Today, we took a look at the studio at the University of Wisconsin. And I can't believe how strong this wind is. We want to welcome our viewers in the United States and around the world. And now welcome inside the broadcast booth, everybody. I'm Joe. We're here at the Big Ten studio at Camp Randall Stadium, taking a look at the remote broadcast facilities that we've been using this season. Announcers have been calling games off-site due to reduced travel parties. This has become commonplace in TV, and I just wanted to show you what we're dealing with. Here you see monitors that are used for the announcers during the game. This is where we would display the feeds. These feeds can come in via Teradek Cube, as you see here. The Teradek is a peer-to-peer -peer video encoder where there's a transmit and a receive end. So on one end, someone would be transmitting a signal, and then we pick it up here via IP. We also use RTMP feeds, which are basically what the social media platforms use. But there can be an RTMP server where someone can directly push to it, and we can get it taken down from there. Here's a monitor. That's used by an engineer, we'll come back to this station. Here's another announcer position. The play-by-play -play position here, this is where the play-by-play -play announcer would have their mixer. And then we also have a color commentator spot. You see the tablet there, that's for stats. Looking back in this direction, we have audio connections. They're coming off of an SDI DM better. That's where an engineer would sit on a larger broadcast like our men's basketball or our football shows. Another thing to note is the difference in the types of feeds that we receive. You see that we've got a full screen picture up right now. Sometimes during the game we'd have a full screen up there, and then other times we would get a multi-viewer. The announcers really preferred the multi-viewers because it showed them everything. But for smaller sports, that just wasn't an option. The configurations of a studio like this are endless, especially if you have fiber connections. Let me know what you thought about this, or if you have a studio of your own. Do you want me to go more in depth in these types of videos? I'd love to know below in the comments. I leave you now with video of John Audius and Pete Waite calling Wisconsin Volleyball in the NCAA Tournament off of a monitor. Thank you for watching. Stepping back to serve is Grace Loeber. Badger fans in Omaha on their feet. Oberg leans into the serve. Bad pass. Here comes Florida with the buff set. Caesar. Blocked by Wisconsin. <laughs> Goodbye, Gators. The Badgers are still unbeaten. And the top seed is moving on to the final four for the second straight season. What a great way to finish. A monster block by Reggie. And, and again, good serve. They, Florida didn't pass so well. They're out of system. She just gets up and bangs it. But she bangs it hard and it comes down even faster.